Can I ask you a question? How confident are you with the security of your online identity? And how proactive are you being to secure it? Well, most likely if you're watching this video, then you're one of the few proactive ones who wants to secure your online identity. Or you've had something that has happened to you beforehand and you want to protect yourself. Now, in just one of hundreds of examples, on April 2014, the NSA revealed a huge, huge vulnerability named the Heartbleed bug. Now, this bug would soon affect well over two-thirds of the companies on the web that are using SSL certificates. So, it's the at the top, if you see the HTTPS, that's the SSL or security certificate. Now, can you imagine that this bug alone compromised your passwords and your credit card information that you've typed into these sites, like on major sites like Yahoo and more? And they're easily accessed by hackers worldwide. In fact, if you head on over to Google and you type in Heartbleed Bug Yahoo, you'll actually get a lot of information on how it has affected Yahoo and many other sites as well. And as you can see in this article that is on Yahoo, it says millions of websites may have been leaking critical sensitive data for the past two years. In my mind, that's pretty scary. So in other words, what this does is it basically opens up the security certificate and allows somebody to go in and scoop up the site's encryption keys, user passwords, and site content. Now that does sound quite scary and that was what was happening around the world. And that's just simply one example only. Today I want to help you secure your online identity and fight back. Finally, you get to watch a former web security expert revealing to you how you can protect your identity while surfing online starting today in the step-by-step -step video course. So basically, while 99% of the population won't really do anything until it's too late, you'll be ahead of everyone else and less of a target. So what I want to do now is just give you a quick video's overview of what we're going to talk about in this video course. Video number one, I'm going to give you an introduction to online security and how it all works. Video two, we're going to talk about online protection 101, things you should not do, things you should avoid doing, and so forth. Video number three, we're going to talk about antivirus software and firewall software, which are two different things. We talk about spyware and malware protection, which is different than antivirus software. We'll talk about passwords and how to create a spreadsheet that will centralize all your passwords together so that if anything were to happen again like this, then you can easily go and change your passwords right away. So setting this up the first time will actually save you time in the long run. So instead of spending hours and hours and hours and hours every single couple of months, change your passwords, you can do this within less than an hour. And then of course, video number six is browser password breach. Did you know that if you click save password, anytime you log into a site on your browser and it saves the passwords in your browser, somebody could easily retrieve that information, especially if you're in a public computer and things like that. So I wanna make sure that you're aware of this so you know exactly what to do. Now, we're also going to talk about centralizing and encrypting your passwords with a piece of software. And then we're going to talk about surfing security, how you can protect yourself as you surf the internet, and how to spot phishing scams. You've probably heard a lot of phishing scams where a big company will pretend like they are maybe your bank, maybe a company that you use, and the real whole goal is to get your username and password and ultimately your credit card information. So I'm going to show you basic steps as well as advanced steps on how to figure out if a site is phishing and trying to scam you. I'm also going to talk about what to do if your identity has been taken. For example, your credit cards, your credit information. What do you do at that point? So in this specific video training course, you're going to be able to watch over my shoulder step by step, click by click and learn how to implement the system right away. So you'll actually get to see me as I show you step by step.
So besides this video right now being PowerPoint, most of the videos that you'll watch in the video course will actually be screen capture video. In other words, you'll actually see me show you how to do things click by click. So grab this video course today and take charge of your online identity once and for all.